guys, today it's all about coconut oil. You cook with it, you use it as a beauty product, but did you know you can clean with it? And I'm gonna show you how today. First thing is on your showers, including the shower doors. If they're dirty, they have soap scum on, you're gonna take some coconut oil. Now this one I just got at the grocery store, $4.99 for this great big jar. What we're gonna do is we're gonna take a little coconut oil, a little baking soda, and I just put it on a little plate to use. Gonna take a paper towel or a shop towel, dip it into my coconut oil, into my baking soda, and then I'm going to simply scrub it on to my shower door. And you can use this on the walls too. Now you're gonna work it in really well, and the oil and the baking soda combination scrubs off all of that mess. Then all you're gonna do is take a paper towel and buff it off, and then you can just rinse it down good the next time you take a shower. It's that easy. And the door will be squeaky clean, and it keeps some of the spots off because it's an oil base. Now next, have the kids colored on the walls. Take a little bit of coconut oil on a paper towel, wipe the wall off, and you're done. Now let's move along to black scrape marks on your floors. And I know it happens a lot when you have so many people over for the holidays. So if you have scuff marks from people's shoes on your floors, you're just gonna take again a little coconut oil and you're gonna rub that in to those marks. And I'm just again using a shop towel and I'm just gonna work it in and then I'm gonna buff it off. And if it's on the floor, make sure you wash it when you're done so it's not slick. But look at the way it took that off. It's so easy to use. Now, for leather, now this could be furniture, it could be coats, it could be pants, shoes, boots, purses, briefcases, anything. It works great. Now, I'm gonna use a microfiber cloth on this. And again, I'm gonna just take a little, I mean, a little goes such a long way with this. I'm gonna put it onto the boot. I'm gonna work it in, and what I do is I leave it on for a little while. I let it penetrate so it can condition, and it adds a little waterproofing too. When you're done, then you're gonna simply buff that off, and I just want you to look at the shine on that boot. Look at the shine that's on that. It conditioned, and it had some waterproofing to it. Now, in the kitchen, it's great for your bread bed bread boards. That was hard to say. Um, if you have a carving board, if you have one that you cut vegetables on, clean it first with some lemon juice. It's a great disinfectant. Then all you're going to do again is you're going to just take your coconut oil, put it onto a paper towel or a shop towel, and work it into that board. It will seal it so that nothing can penetrate. It protects it and it conditions it. And because you can eat it, you don't have to worry about chemicals. And now, it works on your car too, and this is my little ride, but it takes off bed bugs, uh, or bug stains and scum, and any kind of dirt that's on the car from a trip, it does a great job. Last but not least, guys, you've been asking me about the bed bug finders at the store. On the Cyber Monday sale, they're half price on the store. Find them before they find you at queenofclean.com. Guys, thank you so much for talking dirty with the Queen of Clean. Check me out on Facebook and Instagram at Real Queen of Clean and on YouTube on the Queen of Clean channel. See you next time.